We got a pretty good sized parking lot, so a lot of the miles have been put on in the parking lot. Oh yeah? Yeah. That that's pretty zippy. Yeah. Like I gotta hold this camera so it doesn't zip off my hand. I think we put a, a like almost 100 miles on in the parking lot. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah, before we had a license on it. So it's not a problem keeping up with traffic. No, it's a. Uh, and it, this is the min. It's a set at minimum power, meaning that. Uh, this motor, the motor at the back there is capable of uh, three times the power that we're putting out now. 10-inch forklift motor. It's a 10-inch forklift motor? Yeah, it's probably a uh, 100-year-old technology. So you got a 100-year technology in a revolutionary new electric car. Yeah. Electric, yeah. not a car, it's a, it's a what vehicle. Do you call it? It's a vehicle. It's a vehicle. That's why it's switch vehicles. So what are some of the tweaks that you're going to have to be doing with this? Over? Well, we just changed the front shocks and, it, and they're feeling, it was a little too stiff. Now they're fe actually feeling really good now. So is there a price point that you're going to try to hit with the kit? Yeah, yeah. We definitely want to be under $15,000. There's credits too. In California, I think we have $3,500 of tax credit. Mm. So we're going on a hill test or something? Yeah, this is a good size hill here. To go on a bumpy road. Uh, oh, that's right. You're yeah. looking for the bumpiest roads in Sonoma County. Yeah. Uh, this road's pretty nice. Oh, I know where it is. So is this uh, your commuter car now? You know, I haven't used it that much. We've oh. been down the shop. Here it goes. Here we go, the bumpy. That's all right. It's all right with the bumps, that's right. Didn't feel very many of them. Yeah, actually, I aim for them. You're aiming for them? Yeah. Yeah, that's a lot better. <laughs> three-wheelers handle bumps better. It's like shocking. But... Oh, that's right, we're in a three-wheeler. Yeah, you see two in the front. But it's really loose on the roll axis like this, so it hits the bump, it moves like that. A regular car, it's gotta absorb it to come up. It's got, think of it like a three-legged stool. You know, with just three legs, it's always gonna be on the ground. So. The, this wheel comes up and it just shifts a little bit. So we just go through the bumps with a little bit of a roll. It's kind of nice. You got cardboard over here, what, just to keep the pebble? We're uh, experimenting uh, where the air is flowing to see what, what it takes. Oh, okay. It changes day to day, you know? Oh, yeah. I guess uh, cardboard is easy to change. <laughs> it's easy to change, yeah. There 
call it CAD. CAD, cardboard aided design. Oh yeah? You've heard, you've heard of CAD. <laughs> So it's all happening here in the uh, sleepy little town of Sebastopol. Yeah, yeah. Why <laughs> Sebastopol? You yeah, can have yeah. your pick of anywhere you want to be. It, this is like the center of everything. <laughs> Sebastopol is. It's like Sonoma County is like the green center of California. You know, in my opinion, California is like the green part of the United States, and people, you know. I think it's it's a certain kind of leadership that seems to be here, you know. Where, uh, How long something. have you been in Sonoma County? Since '95, 15 years, 16 years. Yeah, 16 years. Yeah, yeah, it goes fast. You started in Oakland. Started in Oakland, East Bay. Yeah. East Bay, and then you've come up here to Sonoma County, 15, yeah. 16 years. Yeah. It's just is it the people, the climate? No, the climate's. Not a, no, it's not that much different. Um, it's a good size, you know. Like the city itself is only about eight thousand people. Are there like-minded people up here? Like yeah, uh, definitely, like definitely. Yeah, you say it's um, you've got a really good support. You know, like uh, people are really looking for a change. They're looking for uh, alternatives. You know. But the way I see it is we're, we're providing options, and that's the best thing we can do. We can't force anybody to do anything, but we can, we can provide an option. So the option that we'd like to provide with our company is a low-cost electric vehicle that's, that's practical, inexpensive to operate, and, and fun, and something you'd be proud to own and uh, you won't have any trouble with. This is our biggest bump here. Your biggest bump. You want to hang on? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Did you feel that though? We left the ground. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. It's, and it's pretty smooth too. It's got a lot of travel. <laughs> well, it's nice that you have the biggest bump in your backyard. Here. Yeah. yeah. Hey, it works great. It's a lot better. Yeah. Yeah. We didn't have to buy anything. Keep finding stuff. <laughs>